Hello and welcome to episode 130. 130. Can you imagine? It seems like only 50 days ago we were on episode 80. Hmm. Anyway, welcome to episode 130 of the Daily Sales Message, where each and every single day for at least the last 130 days in succession, we haven't missed a day yet, don't plan to, I provide you with a piece of simple and actionable advice that's designed to help you feel more confident and sell more stuff too. Isn't that nice of me to do that? That's nice, isn't it? The main thing for me is to make a difference because sales and selling is really intimidating. It can be scary, but it needn't be. Selling is just a skill like any other, and I'm on a mission to demystify it. I've classified it into 510 different individualized components. We talk about a lot of them on uh, the podcast here. Tons of them uh, feature my methodologies and trainings, etc. But they're all actionable, real-world, simple things. There's no trickery, no need to push, persuade, convince, cajole people. It's all really about good communication being comfortable talking to people and making sure people are comfortable when they talk with you. In today's episode of the Daily Sales Message, we're talking about the adjective effect. The adjective effect. Basically, an adjective is a descriptive word. An adjective is a descriptive word. The more descriptive words that you put in front of something, the higher the price you can charge for it or the easier it is for somebody to justify a higher price. And this happens a lot in the world of food and restaurants. So we take something like smoked salmon, that could then become Scottish smoked salmon. It could be fresh Scottish smoked salmon. It could be fresh ad fluvial Scottish smoked salmon. And yes, I had to Google the word ad fluvial to know what that means, so you have to do that too. It could be fresh Add fluvial Scottish smoked salmon from the Lerwick and Bray Islands. Essentially, the more words that you use, the more descriptive words, the more adjectives, the fancier this thing sounds. It's still the same piece of fish. It's a bit of smoked salmon. Very nice. But the more words you use to describe it, the easier it is to justify the price or to charge more for it because it's sounding fancier and fancier by the second isn't it obviously with the caveat we're not going to lie about this and say it's something it's not so it would need to actually be fresh actually be scottish salmon actually be from that location etc but using those terms to add descriptors helps to improve and increase this notion of justifying the price and charging more for something so my challenge for you today is to think about how can you add more descriptives into the services or the products, and it's more suited to products really, the products and services that you offer. Obviously, we don't want to make things complicated and unwieldy. I'm the clear sales message guy after all. I like to be as concise and short as possible, but there's definitely space and definitely a market for very, very long named things and using that as a mechanism to make them sound more expensive or to justify the price so that's it for this episode of the daily sales message tomorrow we're going to be talking about one of my all-time favorite drinks guinness we're going to be talking about guinness tomorrow something in particular that they do in their marketing whether you drink guinness or not you will have almost certainly have heard of this mechanism this phrase they've used in their marketing and then their advertising and i'll explain to you why it exists and how perhaps you could also use it in your own business that's it for this episode thank you very much for listening or watching to the end if you haven't already do reach out and connect with me on linkedin i'm very active there on the platform and also really nice i uh, also like to receive direct messages dms connection requests from people it's lovely to get a conversation going to understand how the daily sales message has influenced you and any results that you've had from following the advice and the strategies and structures that i share here i've heard from people all across the world who've been listening to the daily sales message implemented some of this stuff and had great results and keeps me going and it makes us all worthwhile doesn't it so thanks very much for your time and attention i shall see you tomorrow for a pint of guinness